Hello everyone. In today's tutorial we're going to be discussing RoboForm and we're going to discuss what it is. We're also going to download a copy so you can see the benefits of what RoboForm does. And so I'll walk you through the process uh, to begin with. However, let's discuss what is RoboForm. Well, RoboForm is a password management and web form filling program that automates password entering and form filling. Basically what that means is it saves a password um, your password conveniently at the top of your web browser and it sort of looks like a favorites button. You can also use it to fill out web forms at an instant. I mean it's super laser fast. You just save the information uh, in your RoboForm system at the top of your browser and then whenever you get to a form it'll you just click that button and it automatically fills it in. Really cool. So who makes RoboForm? It was developed by Cyber Systems Incorporated it's available for many web browsers, including Internet Explorer, Firefox, Google Chrome. It also works for mobile devices, such as Palm and Pocket PC. However, RoboForm does not work for Mac computers. I do apologize, sorry for that Mac users, but you should check out a similar program called LastPass. LastPass.com works the same as RoboForm, and it works for Macs. Just so you can get a snapshot, here's what Robo, uh, what LastPass looks like. Just go to, bring you up here, LastPass.com, and you'll be able to take a look at the site. And then over here, as you can see, you can download it for free as well. So you can download it for free, or you can get the LastPass Premium Package, which starts off at a dollar per month. Really cool. Anyway, back to RoboForm, and the next question you're probably asking, is RoboForm safe? Well, it is safe. It's used by several Fortune 500 companies, such as IBM, Computer Associates, and Fujitsu Software Company. Also, RoboForm was named PC Magazine's Editor's Choice and CNETDownload.com's Software Choice of the Year in 2004. The fact that it was done in 2004 should tell you it's been around a while, so it is considered safe and it, it does have a good rating. Next, if you're still not sure about the safety of RoboForm on your computer, then you should, I, well, actually I recommend you get RoboForm to go. It downloads on the USB flash drive and this is what a USB flash drive looks like if you don't know what I'm talking about. Uh, these little flash drives, they hold a ton of memory and they plug into your computer and it can, you can purchase them at Walmart, Target, or any specialty computer store. And in today's tutorial, I'll be downloading the software to my USB flash drive. So, let's head over to RoboForm. Now, the way you get to RoboForm is you simply go to RoboForm.com. Once you get here, you're going to click on the button that says Download. And as you can see, you've got a couple of choices here. You've got RoboForm V6.1.1, and then you've also got RoboForm to go. And the one that I'm going to be focusing on is RoboForm to go. So all you'll simply do is click this button here. It's a download option. Once you do that, one of the things I highly recommend is that you open up your flash drive. Uh, you know and have it on your desktop ready just so you can download it to it and let me show you what it looks like after you click the button open up the flash drive and it'll download what's called a RoboForm portable and once you click on the RoboForm portable it's going to ask you to put a master um, master uh, password and you enter the master password twice and then it downloads your portable RoboForm which is right here now what's cool about the portable RoboForm is anytime you put in your flash drive into your system, it autom it gives you it prompts you to have all of this information set up here. Now this is all information from RoboForm. And so what what this does is this password protects your sites. And I'm gonna give you a small demo of that right now. So let me click on this and I'm gonna go to a uh, mail account uh, mail.com this is a, a site where you can get as many email accounts as you want and um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how cool this really is now 
this is the mail.com site and you would simply put your you know your uh, password information here your email address and your password and then click sign in but instead of doing that here's what we're gonna do we're gonna open up another browser okay and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to logins and I'm gonna go to mail it automatically pulls up the site automatically fills in the password information and it automatically logs you in you don't even have to be at the site all you have to do is go up to the logins button and click on it and it, then it downloads it now one thing I do want to point out to you in RoboForm is that uh, your free download copy that you get here only stores 10 um, you know passwords and 10 web forms now if you want to upgrade you have to go to buy pro and in the buy pro section you can get the license for your computer your desktop for twenty nine ninety five now what I recommend is if you look down here RoboForm to go license is normally thirty nine ninety five you can get it now for nineteen ninety five now let me tell you the importance of this what's important about this is you can take this and plug it in to uh, any computer, your computer or a client's computer, or if you have more than one computer, plug it in and use it anywhere. So this is like an anywhere you go, you have RoboForm with you, and it's really awesome. So I would recommend getting this one at the discount, nine ninety five, nineteen ninety five. Sorry, instead of just one for your let your desktop computer at twenty nine ninety five. Hopefully you enjoyed this tutorial and stick with me for any additional tutorials I may have. Thanks. I'd like to thank you for viewing this video tutorial for RoboForm. I do have one correction to make, and I do apologize. You do have to download the original um, RoboForm program onto your computer before you can get RoboForm 2 Go. And so that will drive up your costs. So you may want to start off with just the RoboForm program and decide if it's something you want to keep for longer, and then you can get the RoboForm to Go. I do apologize again. Thanks for viewing, and there is a link for the video uh, for RoboForm access below.